my T-bone steak with easy Bernays sauce. The T-bone's already on, just salt and pepper, very simple, seared on both sides, on my flat top here so none of the juices drip down into there. And I'm gonna tent it, all right? Very smart, after you grill meat, or cook meat, you wanna tint it before you actually cut into it so those juices can redistribute. Now, onto this easy Bernays sauce, which is really just like the child of a hollandaise sauce when you think about it. I do a one, two, three hollandaise sauce that I'm gonna zhuzh up and make it into Bernays. So, the one is one stick of butter, melted. It's gonna go into my blender. Oh yeah, I'm doing it in the blender, okay? Now, to that, two egg yolks, okay? Put those in and then three teaspoons of lemon juice. Typically, a Bernays has some white wine vinegar, but I'm subbing with lemon juice. A little salt. And blitz it. Okay. Slow it first. You wanna aerate slightly. You wanna bring it up. You wanna go a little bit harder. Keep on going. Turn it up higher. Oh, now we're talking. All right, so now once everything is mixed in, and the blender's had a time to like incorporate some air into the situation. It's a good time to stop it and add in some of my fresh herbs. I'm gonna get this into my double boiler over here, only really because it's kind of chilly out here. But plus, we all know, once it's not warm anymore, it's not a real good sauce. You wanna keep it nice and warm. All right. Now, let me get the herbs into the game plan. Usually, you'll see like tarragon, but I love fresh thyme, so I'm gonna just get that right in there. A little bit of red onion, chopped up nice. Get that in there as well. And then some fresh chive. Why not? Get a little classy with it. I love chives. All right, got the chives good to go. Gonna shuffle those into my sauce, give it a nice fold. You know what really makes a Bernays sauce is that oniony flavor, right? So we got the chives in there, the red onions. All right, time for the steak. Now, let me get this into my little bowl here so that I might serve it classy-like. At home, I would just go straight to the table with this bowl, but we would like to present you some classic recipes today. I gotta tell you, this is perfect for a date night. And like I said, anything you can imagine hollandaise on, Bernays. So asparagus that you grill, any kind of really roasted vegetables would be great. So let me get that T-bone. Now remember, this is just very simple. Get it onto the grill. Look at how beautiful that T-bone is. And then, very easy, right over the top. Mmm. The child of a mother sauce, Bernays. Oh yeah, all over it, all over it. And there you have it. What do you guys think? Pretty simple, right?